What's going on guys? I am back with another wrestling video. Alright. I hope everyone's doing well and on this beautiful day. So the rumor is for uh, Survivor Series, the rumor is of right now, as of right now, Gunther, yeah, Gunther, will, pit, will put his WWE World Heavyweight Championship on the line against CM Punk. That's a rumor. I think it's going to be true because it, Punk's already teasing it. Um, but Punk is not winning it. No. Gunther might destroy him. He's, Gunther's going to chop him up. Man, he's going to chop him up with those chops he, he does. Gunther's not losing that title until next year. Um, right, um, WWE Raw has now appeared uh, in the coming soon section of Netflix featuring its updated logo. Um, I looked. Uh, if you see it, that's the logo. I checked on my Netflix, um, the, like in the coming soon. I didn't see it, but I don't know what this is. I don't know if this is the UK, but I keep checking. I'll let you know if I see it. All right, AEW baby, Shelton Benjamin will take on Swerve Strickland. Um, it's official for the Fright Night Dynamite. It's like a Halloween edition. It's called Fright Night. Uh, I think Swerve is actually gonna win it, but some shenanigans are gonna. Happened in that match. Maybe Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley could debut. I could see that. Alright. And um, for WWE, Michael Cole will be back on Raw in January when the show moves to Netflix on January 6th. Because of right now, it's Michael Cole and Corey Graves uh, on, Smack on SmackDown. Joe Tessitore, Wade Barrett on Raw. So, Michael Cole is coming back to Raw on January 6th with Pat McAfee. And I think Joe Tessitore will move to SmackDown with Corey Graves and Wade Barrett. Oh yeah, we did that. Um, this is very interesting. Very, very interesting. So Booker T said, I'm definitely going to try to get Zilla Fatu all the way to WWE. That's Jacob Fatu. As you know, Jacob Fatu, he's on SmackDown in the bloodline with Solo Sokoa, Tamatanga, and Tangaloa. But Zilla Fatu, I think he is coming to WWE sometime next year. I'm telling you right now, next year, you'll see Zilla Fatu. I'm going to say on SmackDown with his brother... Jacob Fatu in the bloodline. Because Jacob Fatu... I think Jacob Fatu might... Like, as the virus... Because we all know right now, right now as we speak, as we speak, it's going to be bloodline versus bloodline at the virus series. Jacob Fatu, Solo Sokoa, Tamatanga, Tangaloa, versus Roman Reigns, Jey Uso, Jimmy Uso... And Sami Zayn. I think Jacob Fatu, after Survivor Series, after Survivor Series, he's going to turn on Solo Sokoa. Yep. He's going to turn on Solo. Which will be fantastic. And Jacob Fatu will bring in his brother, Zilla Fatu. And as for Dynamite, AEW Dynamite, this Wednesday, Sammy Guevara versus Shelton Benjamin... Shelton Benjamin will win that match. Uh, this is going to be good. The TNT champion, Jack Perry. The AEW Tag Team Champions, the Young Bucks, the Elite, will verse Daniel Garcia and Private Party. Picking Jack Perry and the Young Bucks, the Elite. And we also got to see what happens with John Moxley. And his faction, because John Moxley is the new AEW World Champion, and I think we're gonna get a new title belt. I think he's we're gonna get a redesigned championship. That's gonna be good, and he's destroying everyone. 
Because we don't know who's working for John Moxley. John Moxley said he's working for someone. He's um doing... He, it's not his company. He told Tony Schiavone that this is not his company anymore. So we got John Moxley, Pac, Claudio Castanoli, uh, Marina Shafir, and uh, Will Yuta. Destroying everyone in WWE. Uh, not WWE. AEW. Destroying everyone in AEW. Um... So we don't know who's gonna stop them. We don't know who's gonna who who they're working for. My, my opinion, like I said, it's Shane McMahon. Shane McMahon's work. Yep, they're listening to Shane McMahon. Shane McMahon's the real leader here. I think we'll find out um more stuff on Wednesday. That that storyline is freaking awesome. AEW has some really good storylines going. The MVP stuff with the Hurt Syndicate. The John Moxley stuff, um, the Jack Perry Young Bucks, the the Elite stuff. There's some really good stories. I'm telling you, like I like I said, WWE is the hottest ever. AEW is very good, but like I said, it's not better than WWE. I love WWE. I love AEW. I love both companies. One's better than the other, but both of them are telling really good stories. So. House of Black is in action. We'll find out who they're versing and what they're focusing on. And we'll hear from Kyle Fletcher. That's another good storyline. The Don Callis family. That's another good one. And that's it. So we got Monday Night Raw tomorrow. Can't wait for Monday Night Raw. It's going to be a big show. Very good. Very good show tomorrow. Uh, AEW Wednesday. It's going to be a very good Dynamite. Then SmackDown on Friday. Let's go Giants. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. So I have time to make a video, get an alert. Peace out.